The Amazon rainforest, also called Amazon jungle or Amazonia, is a moist, broadleaf, tropical rainforest in the Amazon biome that covers most of the Amazon basin of South America. This basin encompasses 7,000,000 km2, 2,700,000 square meter, of which 5,500,000 km2, 12,100,000 square meter, are covered by the rainforest. This region includes territory belonging to nine nations and 3,244 formally acknowledged indigenous territories. The majority of the forest, 60%, is in Brazil, followed by Peru with 13%, Colombia with 10%, and with minor amounts in Bolivia, Ecuador, French Guiana, Guyana, Suriname, and Venezuela. Four nations have Amazonas as the name of one of their first-level administrative regions, and France uses the name Guiana Amazonian Park for French Guiana's protected rainforest area. The Amazon represents over half of Earth's remaining rainforests and comprises the largest and most biodiverse tract of tropical rainforest in the world, with an estimated 390 billion individual trees in about 16,000 species. Large-scale deforestation is occurring in the forest, creating different harmful effects. Economic losses due to deforestation in Brazil could be approximately seven times higher in comparison to the cost of all commodities produced through deforestation. In the Amazonas, there has been fighting and wars between the neighboring tribes of the Javaro. Several tribes of the Jivaron group, including the Shua, practiced headhunting for trophies and head shrinking. The accounts of missionaries to the area in the borderlands between Brazil and Venezuela have recounted constant infighting in the Yanomami tribes. More than a third of the Yanomamo males, on average, died from warfare. The rainforest likely formed during the Eocene era, from 56 million years to 33.9 million years ago. It appeared following a global reduction of tropical temperatures when the Atlantic Ocean had widened sufficiently to provide a warm, moist climate to the Amazon basin. The rainforest has been in existence for at least 55 million years, and most of the region remained free of savanna-type biomes at least until the current ice age when the climate was drier and savanna more widespread. During the mid-Eocene, it is believed that the drainage basin of the Amazon was split along the middle of the continent by the Purus Arch. Water on the eastern side flowed toward the Atlantic, while to the west water flowed toward the Pacific across the Amazonas Basin. As the Andes Mountains rose, however, a large basin was created that enclosed a lake, now known as the Solomos Basin. Within the last 5 to 10 million years, this accumulating water broke through the Purus Arch, joining the easterly flow toward the Atlantic. More than 56% of the dust fertilizing the Amazon rainforest comes from the Bodel Depression in northern Chad in the Sahara Desert. The dust contains phosphorus important for plant growth. The yearly Sahara dust replaces the equivalent amount of phosphorus washed away yearly in Amazon soil from rains and floods. 40 NASA SCALIPSO satellite has measured the amount of dust transported by wind from the Sahara to the Amazon. An average of 182 million tons of dust are windblown out of the Sahara each year at 15 degrees west longitude across 2,600 kilometers 1,600 miles over the Atlantic Ocean ocean some dust falls into the Atlantic then at 35 degrees west longitude at the eastern coast of South America 27 7 million tons 15 of dust fall over the Amazon basin 22 million tons of it consisting of phosphorus 132 million tons of dust remain in the air 43 million tons of dust are windblown and falls on the Caribbean Sea past 75 degrees west longitude 41 Calypso uses a laser range finder to scan the Earth's atmosphere for the vertical distribution of dust dust and other aerosols CALIPSO regularly tracks the Sahara Amazon dust plume CALIPSO has measured variations in the dust amounts transported. Wet tropical forests are the most species-rich biome, and tropical forests in the Americas are consistently more species-rich than the wet forests in Africa and Asia. 45. As the largest tract of tropical rainforest in the Americas, the Amazonian rainforests have unparalleled biodiversity. One in ten known species in the world lives in the Amazon rainforest. 46. 
This constitutes the largest collection of living plants and animal species in the world 47. The region is home to about 2.5 million insect species, 48, tens of thousands of plants, and some 2,000 birds and mammals. To date, at least 40,000 plant species, 49, 2,200 fishes, 50, 1,294 birds, 427 mammals, 428 amphibians, and 378 reptiles have been scientifically classified in the region. 51, 1 in 5 of all bird species are found in the Amazon rainforest, and 1 in 5 of the fish species live in Amazonian rivers and streams. Scientists have described between 96,660 and 128,843 invertebrate species in Brazil alone. The biodiversity of plant species is the highest on Earth with one 2001 study finding a quarter square kilometer, 62 acres, of Ecuadorian rainforest supports more than 1,100 tree species. A study in 1999 found one square kilometer, 247 acres of Amazon rainforest can contain about 90,790 tons of living plants. The average plant biomass is estimated at 356 plus minus 47 tons per hectare. To date, an estimated 438,000 species of plants of economic and social interest have been registered in the region with many more remaining to be discovered or catalogued. 55. The total number of tree species in the region is estimated at 16,000. 4. The green leaf area of plants and trees in the rainforest varies by about 25% as a result of seasonal changes. Leaves expand during the dry season when sunlight is at a maximum, then undergo abscission in the cloudy wet season. These changes provide a balance of carbon between photosynthesis and respiration. Each hectare of the Amazon rainforest contains around 1 billion of invertebrates. The rainforest contains several species that can pose a hazard. Among the largest predatory creatures are the black caiman, jaguar, cougar, and anaconda. In the river, electric eels can produce an electric shock that can stun or kill, while piranha are known to bite and injure humans. Various species of poison dart frogs treat lipophilic alkaloid toxins through their flesh. There are also numerous parasites and disease vectors. Vampire bats dwell in the rainforest and can spread the rabies virus. Malaria, yellow fever and dengue fever can also be contracted in the Amazon region. The biodiversity in the Amazon is becoming increasingly threatened, primarily by habitat loss from deforestation as well as increased frequency of fires. Over 90% of Amazonian plant and vertebrate species, 13,000 to 14,000 in total, may have been impacted to some degree by fires. Amazonia is the largest river basin in the world, and its forest stretches from the Atlantic Ocean in the east, to the tree line of the Andes in the west. The forest widens from a 200-mile, 320-kilometer, front along the Atlantic to a belt 1,200 miles, 1,900 kilometers, wide where the lowlands meet the Andean foothills. The immense extent and great continuity of this rainforest is a reflection of the high rainfall, high humidity, and monotonously high temperatures that prevail in the region. Amazon Basin, the drainage basin of the Amazon River that covers about 34% of the land of South America, about 6,100,000 square kilometers, roughly 2,300,000 square miles, and is located in the center and eastern portions of the continent. The Amazon Basin is the largest drainage basin in the world, more than twice as large as that of the Congo River in Africa. Approximately one-fifth of all freshwater runoff on Earth passes through this watershed. Forests are among the most complex ecosystems in the world, and they exhibit extensive vertical stratification. Conifer forests have the simplest structure, a tree layer rising to about 30 meters, 98 feet, a shrub layer that is spotty or even absent, and a ground layer covered with lichens, mosses, and liverworts. Deciduous forests are more complex, the tree canopy is divided into upper and lower stories, while rainforest canopies are divided into at least three strata. 
The forest floor in both of these forests consists of a layer of organic matter overlying mineral soil. The humus layer of tropical soils is affected by the high levels of heat and humidity, which quickly decompose whatever organic matter exists. Fungi on the soil surface play an important role in the availability and distribution of nutrients, particularly in the northern coniferous forests. Some species of fungi live in partnership with the tree roots, while others are parasitically destructive. Animals that live in forests have highly developed hearing, and many are adapted for vertical movement through the environment. Because food other than ground plants is scarce, many ground-dwelling animals use forests only for shelter. In temperate forests, birds distribute plant seeds and insects aid in pollination, along with the wind. In tropical forests, fruit bats and birds effect pollination and seed dispersal. The forest is one of nature's most efficient ecosystems, with a high rate of photosynthesis affecting both plant and animal systems in a series of complex organic relationships. The Amazon is an incredibly unique place. It is the world's largest rain forest and river system, and the most biologically diverse place on Earth. It contains millions of species, most of them still undescribed. Both the Amazon's forest and freshwater systems are at risk. Since the year 2000, rainfall has declined across 69% of the Amazon forest. WWF estimates that 27% of the Amazon biome will be without trees by 2030 if the current rate of deforestation continues. Protecting and conserving the Amazon is no easy task, but WWF has been working to save this important place. The Amazon is one of Earth's last refuges for jaguars, harpy eagles, and pink river dolphins, and it is home to sloths, black spider monkeys, and poison dart frogs. It contains one in ten known species on Earth, 40,000 plant species, 3,000 freshwater fish species, and more than 370 types of reptiles. Over 2,000 new species of plants and vertebrates, including a monkey that purrs like a cat, have been described since 1999. This vast region, about two-thirds the size of the U.S., spans eight countries, Brazil, Bolivia, Peru, Ecuador, Colombia, Venezuela, Guyana, Suriname, and the overseas territory of French Guiana. Covering about 40% of South America, the Amazon contains 1.4 billion acres of dense forests, half of the planet's remaining tropical forests, 4,100 miles of winding rivers and 2.6 million square miles in the Amazon basin, dot home to more than a thousand different species of birds like hummingbirds, channel-billed toucans, hoatsins and macaws, the Amazon is one of the most diverse areas for birds in the world. Macaws, an icon of the Amazon, are highly intelligent and social, living in flocks of 10 to 30 birds. They mate for life and can live up to 60 years. Some species can even mimic human speech. But macaws are under threat from deforestation and the illegal pet trade. Now enjoy the beautiful clips of Amazon forest and Amazon wildlife.